I feel deeply privileged to introduce to the dear audience of Kuwait Television our guest, Eleanor, who is known by this Kuwaiti name, Noura. And I would like to have this opportunity to uh, medicines. Please, uh, then I will give you. Shukra. Ismi Noura. Noura. The Arab children used to say, Noura, Noura, Atini Sura. They used to say to my sister, Gamasha, Gamasha Tamasha. And my sister, Grace, they didn't have a nickname for her. Sometimes they would say, Halima, Naima, Halima. Naima Halima. I am delighted to be here. It's been 56 years that I've been waiting to come back to Kuwait. My mother, as you said, was the first lady doctor in Kuwait. She came here when the Kuwait women knew very little about medicine. I remember her telling about the first cataract operation she ever, she ever performed, ever, on anybody. She had performed it on animals in medical school, but never on a human being. A woman came in from the desert, a Bedouin woman came on a camel with her husband when my mother just had this little room in the town of Kuwait where she operated. She came to her, to my mother, and my mother looked at her eyes and saw this eye needed a cataract operation. She said to the woman and her husband, you stay here this night in the courtyard. In the morning, I will do the operation. And you will have to stay here with your husband and your camel. They had come on a camel from the desert. And I will take care of you until you are all well. And then she went to her own room, and she read everything about the cataract. Mm -hmm. She was frightened. She had never done it on a person. And she prayed to Allah. <laughs> Please, please, please help me. In the morning, she did the operation on the woman. She removed the cataract. The husband of this woman helped her move the patient onto her mat on the courtyard. And mother put sandbags on either side of her head. And she said, don't move. She said to her husband, don't you let her move. I'm going to go and nurse my baby. I will be back. I will be back, and I want to see everything quiet, just the same as it is now. Don't move. She went back and nursed her baby, came back. The woman was gone. The husband was gone. The camel was gone. And mother th thought, oh, no. My first operation, and this will ruin any reputation I might have. Mm -hmm. But many years later, the woman came back oh, with her husband on a camel and said to her, Halima, Halima, you saved my eye. You saved my eye. Now do this eye. I see. Well, nowadays, I you that I remember that we had a Christmas dinner, yeah. and mother had the cook cook a habara, yeah. habara, yeah. and the sheikh came. I see. He had for my mother in a white cloth mm -hmm. one hundred pearls yes. from the Arabian Gulf. I see. One hundred pearls. Mm -hmm. She had a necklace made from these pearls. Uh -huh. And when she died, the Christmas story, the Christmas story from yeah. the Gospel of, uh, yeah. according to Saint I Luke, and Mother had us learn the whole story from the Bible yeah. so that we could say it yeah. when the Sheikh came to visit on that Christmas yeah. day. Uh -huh. And would you like me to tell? Yeah, it yeah, to well, you? just to hear. Wakan fi tilk al kura. Roat Matabadin Yahrasun Harasat Lail 
على رعيتهم وإذا ملاك الرب وقف بهم ومجد الرب أضع حولهم فخافوا خوفا ديما فقال لهم الملاك لا تخافوا فها أن أبشركم بفرق أذيم يكون لجميع الشعب أنه ولد لكم اليوم في مدينة داود مخلص هو مسيح الرب وهذه تكأت وهذه لكم الألامة تجدون طفلا مقامة مذجئا في مذود وظهر بغتة مع الملاك جمهور من الجند السماوي مسبهين الله فكاعلين المجد لله في العالي وعلى الأرض السلام وبناس المسرة Uh, and we, all three of us, uh, learned this, yeah. and we recited uh, it for the chef. Yeah. That was that was a great pleasure. Uh, you know, uh, you uh, uh, told me that uh, you were in a visit, His Highness, uh, the before you are uh, leaving, uh, you know, Kuwait. You were in a visit to His Highness. You know, the Amir to say goodbye to him. Yes. And he uh, gave you uh, a present. He gave you and pre all the sisters. That's right. You see, give, uh, he gave each of us. First of all, what, what kind of this present and uh, what is the, happened for you the present? Well, he gave each of us a gold ring. Gold ring. A gold ring with a turquoise in it, just yes. the color of his dress. Yeah. And a gold barrette yes. with a turquoise in it. Yeah. This was just before we left, which was in April 1929. 19? 1929. 29. Yes. Mm. Well, before we left, we, um, our father made us stand in a row, Wahad Thanein for inspection to see if we were clean and neat. And he looked at Grace and he said, You look very fine, Zane. He looked at Elizabeth, he said, you look very fine, Zayn. He looked at me, Noura. He said, go upstairs and wash your hands and comb your hair. Mm -hmm. I went upstairs, I took off the ring and washed my hands. I took off the barrette and combed my hair. Ran downstairs, stood in line to be inspected. He said, you look better. And we went off to the launch that would take us to the boat, to yeah. Basra. Uh -huh. And I left my ring uh -huh. and my barrette in that house Hi. in Kuwait. Mm. And when I realized that I didn't have them, I cried and mm. cried. Mm. And I feel like crying about yeah, it now. But, uh, Nuna, why, why are you... Arabic. Yeah, uh, I'm very sorry uh, I didn't, because I think... The written Arabic is beautiful. Yeah, I wish I, I could do it. I my father, may I tell yeah. you what my father used to do at breakfast? Yes. I'd bring my piece of toast to him, yes. and he'd take a spoonful of dibs. Dibs, yes. Yes, and he would write my yeah. name, dibs pouring it like this on the toast. Uh -huh. Noon, wow, right. Hete, Nura. Nura, I And see. that's how I learned to spell my name. I see. With the dibs on the toast. I see, I see. Uh, what to say about you? I would like to say... and what... Uh, I and would what like... To, could you advise this new generation here? I remember that my father said, after oil was discovered, Yeah. he said, I hope that this sudden wealth will not spoil the character of Kuwait. I see. The could, dignity. Could you repeat it again, please? I hope that the sudden. That's what the doctor. My father. Your father. My uh, father said. Yeah, uh, I hope that the sudden explosion of wealth yes, in Kuwait yeah, will not spoil uh, the Arab character. The Arab character. He said, I think it will not. Uh, and we hope. We hope. We hope that we will hope. not. I, you know, when the plane landed on Tuesday night, just as the wheels came down. I saw the color of the sand of Kuwait, and yes. I saw the color yeah. of the thorns of Kuwait. Uh -huh. And 
I, I was very, very moved yeah. just to be back in Kuwait yeah. and see these same colors. Yeah. Well, now, since then, yeah. I've seen lights, I've seen fountains, I see, I see flowers everywhere, yeah. I see fresh fruit, mm. but there is a little bit of the souk, the I old see. souk that has been I saved. Yeah. And my husband and I have been there and back and back, I and I wanted to buy, I did buy the... Yeah. The Istakan, Istakana, yes, the yeah, Pinjan, yeah, Finajin, yes, 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 